Well, it's great. You know, you, you work so hard uh, in a program to, to, to put it in the map and then to teach the right, uh, uh, right fundamentals of the game you love and you respect. And you get kids that, that come out of every walk of life, you know, public school system, private school system, somewhere else, and they trust what, what, what you're teaching them. And, and they worked hard. It's, it's an amazing feeling uh, when you do things uh, the right way. And I always do things the right way. Uh, to leave uh, as a champ, you know, eight seniors, uh, seven going to play college baseball. A year prior to that, five seniors, uh, four playing college baseball. It's a great accomplishment not only to, to what I do, but to the kids that, that, that follow uh, a dream and, and, and a sport that they love and they respect. And I'm honored. I'm honored to have led them to a state championship. It's not easy. People don't understand the things you go through uh, in a dugout where there's different personalities, uh, different backgrounds, but then we only have one saying in his family and respect we have a death chart and that's how we do it uh, kids work together we don't believe in uh, baseball by the ages we don't believe in baseball by seniority we believe in baseball by talent and how hard you play the game in between the lines so it doesn't matter to me if you're a ninth grader or you're a 12th grader if you respect the game you follow my lead you'll get to play and that's why kids want to play for me and that's why I do it this way I don't believe in punishment I believe in teachings I believe in talking to this uh, generation needs more talking and more teachings and punishment so we don't run after we lose we don't run after we win we run all the time doesn't matter if we win or lose we just work out so we respect the game we honor the game and and I'm glad that these eight seniors got to taste of what being a champion is it feels good because last year we went but we ended up losing 1-0 so it feels good with my fellow seniors over here to win the championship and then eventually have the ring on my finger the whole season was just a great season we just had a good time we came closer as a team, um, and then state game, I mean, there was a bunch of stuff that went down in the hotel that was crazy. And um, this is just uh, the vibe in the dugout, the whole game, everybody was uh, energetic, it was, it was a good time. I'm glad that, that all of us are going to go in the history book, I mean, we kind of, we deserve it. Like, the first time in history, that's pretty cool. It feels good, we did, we've worked hard all year, we've had practice when pretty much nobody has practice, we've worked all day, everything. We, we're in the field for like two to three hours. We put in our heart, sweat, tears, everything. We just work hard. We, we deserve it. We, we made it there. We showed them what we could do, and we, we took it. It was uh, pretty special because when I got there my sophomore year, we really didn't have a, a baseball team. We had a couple baseball players, but we had to bring a couple uh, volleyball players and soccer players. Coach Padron had to work with what he had, and we still pulled off a 500 season, which was pretty good. The year after that, uh, people started coming in. They started hearing about what was going on in Westwood, and we made it the final. We made it the finals, but we lost 1-0. Uh, a little Texas Lee ran back at first base, and that's all I remember. And this year, we basically came back with our. That was our number one plan: just take the gold. It really means a lot, especially you were at Westwood. Everybody would just talk about, oh yeah, there's a lot of passes there, a lot of horses, just in the middle of horse country, and now people talk about it as a baseball. Like, tra not tradition, but it could start. At the beginning, like when it just happened, like it was kind of like a, it wasn't a shock, but like it didn't like hit me until later. But the celebration was nice. After, like you, you actually see like what you actually did. And we've accomplished a lot. Our team, we've come from a long way. We work all day, every day. When, when it came up to the, close to the playoff start, we're uh, working on Saturdays, so six days a week. And when it rained, we were in the gym running, doing conditioning, doing something that will help us uh, achieve what we achieved, which was, which was the state championship. It felt great coming, going back to the finals, uh, helping my team out, uh, especially that, that it's my senior year, just coming back and, and helping them out to, to the state finals. We're, we're honored to win state champs, and especially as seniors, to win state champs. And... And going to college with a state championship ring means a lot to people. Next year, I'll be I'll be attending uh, University of Miami, playing in their baseball field. And there's there's different routes too. There's I got June 6, um, the MLB draft. Uh, I'm not sure how this is, that's gonna work out, but we just have to wait till June 6 and have them offer me. Uh, I could be a clown when it comes to you know messing around like things like that you know with Coach Padron and some of the players but I'm the one that basically talks in the team and motivates the dugout. It was the best performance I've ever seen. I mean I didn't expect uh, I expected a lot from Danny you know he was throwing gas but you know I saw Jason you know and 
I saw him through, through the, throughout the game in the third inning. He got a little bit complicated, but um, I saw Jason execute when he had to, and he did his job. Every time we you know we say you know we come out to the field, we always say family because it's true. You know, have one mind, one goal, which was states that we won this year. Uh, becoming a doctor, going to school. I mean, out of the 18 years, only seven of them signed to go play ball. I mean, I'm gonna go for grades and you know pursue my dream. Uh, it sunk in already. Yeah, after the after the final pitch, ah, uh, excitement just ran through my body. Uh, just a great feeling. Uh, it's uh, it's amazing for us eight seniors to come out of high school with a state championship ring and trophy. It's just a great feeling. We're a really close team. We're a family. They're all my brothers.